Hi guys and welcome back to the farmhouse. I am DM from Hummingbird Acres and today we are going to work with some peach pits that we got from our favorite orchard in Virginia. If you remember, we canned these peaches a couple of days ago and I saved the pits. So what we're gonna do today is we are gonna crack these pits open, get the seed out, and we are gonna try and germinate them. This is a great way to grow your orchard very, very cheaply. So let's get started. The first thing we're gonna do is I have my drill with a drill bit on it, and we're gonna put some holes in these clear plastic cups. Using clear plastic cups, that way we can see the root growth as these start to grow. And then we can determine when we need to pop them up. I'm thinking one hole will be fine. Now I'm gonna fill these with our favorite Pro Mix potting soil. We love this potting soil. We have used it to start all of our seeds this year and most of all of our potted plants as well. We've had great success with it. I'll link it below for you guys to check out. This stuff is very dry today, so definitely gonna have to water the soil before we put these seeds in. I'm gonna give these just enough water so that the water runs out the bottom. The great thing about clear cups is you can see the water running through it so you know where it's at. While we wait for the water to kind of percolate in here, we are going to attack these peach pits. So, Peaches have our stone fruit. They have a hard pit inside, and then the seed is actually inside of here. Now, I have seen germinating peach pits done in two ways. And the first way is you plant, let this dry out, you plant it, you let it overwinter, the weather, Mother Nature cracks this open, germinates the seed inside, and it grows. Or if you want a little quicker process, which is what we're gonna do today, we're gonna use some tools to crack this open, pull the seed out ourselves, and plant them. From what I've read and what I've seen online, this should take about two weeks and they should germinate. So you're gonna wanna make sure that you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can check back in and see if these germinated or not. So I asked Granddad for some tools to break these open. I got some channel locks and I got some bolt cutters. He said that the bolt cutters actually worked better than the channel locks. I'm gonna try the channel locks first and we'll see. And I think I'm gonna agree with him. The channel, the bolt cutters might work better, but you can see here, so I pop this open and here is the seed right here. I'm gonna gently, I didn't get this all the way, so I'm gonna gently pull it out. You can see it right there. I'm gonna plant this in one of my cups cover it over, and then add it to our table. Can you go put this over there on that table? I, I'm gonna try the bolt cutters. That actually hurt my finger. So, bolt cutters might work better. And I can uh, maybe get a little more leverage. Maybe granddad should have been here for this project. I might have to try the channel locks again. And just be careful not to pinch my fingers. Yeah, I don't like that. It goes everywhere. And now you can't find the I seed? I found it! <laughs> Hunter found the seed. It went flying across the yard. Nope, he didn't find the seed. All right. Is the seed right here? It's in there. 
No. Where is it? Who knows? All right. Maybe you should have had I don't want it. I don't want it. Maybe you should have had a pink shirt. Is there another one? Let's try it. Let's see if I can get the ball colors to work. Oh, there it is! Okay. There it is. So there. that might have worked a little better. Where's the seed? So I got it like that. Like this. Where's the seed? It's still in there. Saved a lot of extra seeds. Can I save this one for my show? Because I do think the channel locks are better, oh, but oh, perfect. I save they this. send the seeds flying. Here's the seed. Okay. I got two. I got two too. Oh, wait a minute. I found one that went flying. We're going to plant that one too. Can I have that one? All right, it's getting a little easier. Here's another one. We have two cups left, so I think we, we should be okay. Actually, we've got one more. I might crack them all and put two seeds in each cup. All right, I'm gonna crack the rest of these and we'll double up on some of the cups. All right, I think we figured this out. Crack it inside of something else and it doesn't go flying as much. We're gonna take these extra seeds and go put a couple of them, do like double up on the cups, and then we will check on them in about two weeks. This is where we have put them, so I'm just gonna go through and add an extra seed to some of these cups, just to give them a little, a little more success rate maybe, we'll see. This spot here gets morning sun and then it gets late afternoon sun. So these should get pretty good conditions for growing, but we'll have to see. Make sure you hit that subscribe and the notification bell so you can come back in about two weeks and check on these with us. Thank you guys so much for hanging out at the farmhouse today and we will talk to you soon.